So I'm working on the Humber diff. At the moment I'm trying to get the backlash right. So what I need to do, if I can do all this with one hand and left hand as well, is undo the, the, bolts, the bolts that hold the um, pin in the sorry the side bearings in. Because I've got to swap a shim from one side to the other, I seem to have a little bit too much backlash. I don't have a dial gauge, but it just feels like way too much. So we'll get those off. Should I keep going with the rubber gun a bit more, shouldn't I? those released I can now move it and take off the short side the bolts that hold the short side of the um, what do you call that thing I suppose the housing take that off can I do that with one hand there you go right, set that aside now inside there there's a fairly big shim it's more of a big spacer it's a different size on both sides of the diff. This one's the bigger one. And in here I've got some tiny shims. I'm going to take that one out. It's the skinniest one. Put the big shim back in. Now I've got to move the whole crown wheel across and slide that little shim in behind the bearing cap. So can you see down there where the shims go? Right, I'm going to turn this off now and fit the shims and I'll get back to you in the next video.